The chain rule. Objectives. Understanding the chain rule for the compound functions. Illustration. Let's assume that a variable quantity y depends on another variable quantity x, and x depends on yet another quantity t. Then, the rate of change in y is equal to the product of these two rates of change, and therefore, dy by dt is equal to dy by dx into dx by dt. To understand this better, let's observe a gear system where a gear chain connects at least two gears together in order to transfer power from one to another. There exists a well-established relationship between the rotational speeds of the two gears in a gear chain, which is the product of a gear's radius and its rotational speed, is the same for each of the gears. So, if the radius of gear 1 is twice as big as the radius of gear 2, then gear 2 spins twice as fast as gear 1. Similarly, if gear 2 is twice as big as gear 3, then gear 3 turns twice as fast as gear 2, and the speed of gear 3 is four times the speed of gear 1. To put it differently, the rate of change between gears 1 and 3 is the same as the product of the rate of change between gears 1 and 2 and the rate of change between gears 2 and 3. Therefore, we can say that the total rate of change is the product of the two intermediate rates of change. Illustration Let us take function y to be equal to log of sine x to the base e and find the derivative of the function with respective to x using the chain rule. To find the derivative of the given function y is equal to log of sine x to the base e, let us take u to be equal to sine x. Then, y is equal to log of u to the base e. To find dy by dx, dy by dx is equal to d by dx of log u to the base e. Now, multiplying and dividing by du, we get dy by dx is equal to d by du of log u to the base e multiplied by du by dx. Then, dy by dx is equal to 1 by u multiplied by du by dx. Now substituting u is equal to sine x, we have dy by dx is equal to 1 by sine x multiplied by d by dx of sine x. Again, the derivative of sine x with respect to x is cos x, so dy by dx is equal to 1 by sine x multiplied by cos x. Therefore, dy by dx is equal to cot x. Summary. Mm -hmm.